Hey everyone, Dr. Clearfield here. Today we're gonna to be performing a stem cell procedure known as bone marrow aspirate. And so stem cells can be um, uh, obtained from two different areas on the human body. And one is from adipose tissue and the other is from bone marrow that we typically take from the posterior spine right over here on the iliac crest, the posterior superior iliac spine. And so what we're gonna be doing here today is we're gonna be numbing the patient up, we're gonna be extracting the stem cell bone marrow from them, and then we're gonna be injecting that into, uh, in this case, an arthritic joint. And so if you're interested in learning more about this, then please go to our website at www.motionismedicinedfw.com. Thanks. To harvest the stem cells, first we use the ultrasound to locate the exact location we will be harvesting from. We then sterilely prep the area of the bone marrow harvest located in the posterior hip. We then clean the area so it is sterile. We numb up the area so no pain is felt and then make a small incision. The harvesting tool is then inserted and advanced down to the level of the bone. Using a sterile hammer, it is gently tapped into place allowing us to access the bone marrow cavity. Once in the marrow cavity, an aspirating device is inserted and a syringe allows us to aspirate the stem cells from the bone marrow. This is performed at several levels of depth, allowing us to get the best yield and potency of the stem cells. We then remove the device and clean and bandage the area. This whole procedure takes about 15 minutes to perform from start to finish, and our patient experienced absolutely no pain during the procedure. The last step is injecting the bone marrow aspirate into the area of concern. In this case, we inject it into a knee joint to treat osteoarthritis and a meniscal tear.